like, yeah, I'm back in this video. Street naked, I think. I went out right back. Yeah. You know, it's okay. I said my shoulder's okay. Shoulder's okay. It's wrong. Okay. Right. Okay. Channel off. one, East Wales. Uh, here we go. Just popped straight out. Got like ten minutes ago, one nil up. I was so determined not Can to fucking lose this game. Put it on the ball. Put it on okay, the ball. Okay. Can translate this page. Okay. Let's go to translate. Press translate. Press translate, right? I could press translate and it could translate to English. So instead of Israelian language. So here we go, Google Translate. And this one happens. If you don't know what the translate one happens, so Hebrew to English. That was in Hebrew. The Israel language Hebrew language from Israel. Um okay. Translating come on, translating, please translate. Uh, translate. Here we go, translate. It says, 80 years of voice of Israel broadcast from Jerusalem, 49 years of Israeli television broadcast in Hebrew and Arabic, Seven, 17 years of digital media, web, and poverty broadcast. Thank you for your trust in public broadcasting. This is the end of our broadcast. Wow. Uh, that's IVA from Israel. Just shut it. Let's close it down, doesn't it? You don't, don't, don't read the English right. Don't, don't write it right now. I'm going to speak again because I don't see it in this video. So, because I don't spoil this video, I believe. So, yeah, I'm going to read it again. 80, 80 years of Voice of Israel broadcast from Jerusalem. 49 years of Israeli television broadcast in Hebrew and Arabic. Seven, 17 years of digital media web uh, publication broadcasting thank you for your trust in public broadcasting this is the end of our broadcasts by iba this is iba right now so that's the last one that's the last one right here that was that's right after the eurovision song contest um uh, straight after the big night of eurovision song contest Around Europe and around the world. So. Garden kickabouts into championship shootouts. Championship shootouts. Oh. oh yeah. <laughs> Smash you up. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, review of the I've watched that I was watching Oh my gosh, this episode. This is how I was watching. Oh my god, Star of Force of the Star Crust episode of Star Crushed. This is Top of Years of God. Oh my. Um, Star Crushed episode. I've watched this episode for the final episode of the show called Star vs. the Force of Evil. I was watching it. It looks quite sad at the end. It looks quite nice, so what's a good show? So that's got. That's only one or two seasons in this episode, in every all episodes. That was really, that was short, by the way. This is really short series, really short seasons, one to two. Broken piece of Stars 1, so it makes me wonder if he's going to try to go after, you know, Stars 1 and put the... Yeah, that's what, just like we're after 2. So, yeah, that's complete. But, but you know, then we see, oh my 
my god, we, the, the wheels come up and start just like, listen, I had to let you know this before I left, I wanted to let you know how I feel, and Marco, again, he's still pretty hesitant, but then ultimately we see Star crying, we see those tears come out, she makes her way upstairs, we see all her things just disappear, and it's left in Marco's yeah. room, like, Marco's room is basically just the way it was before Star ever entered, I mean, granted, there's still that giant hole over there, but, you know, Marco's by himself, Star's gone, that's the end of the series, that's the end of the season finale, whatever, so, wow! Oh my god, this was pretty depressing. This was sad. I love you. Good, so I love you, girl. I love you, my beautiful oh, star. Peace. Was, you know, if you're watching this for a star, but I'm going to eat and share. So, but right now. So, yeah, so here we go. After, you know, stars one and put the other piece inside of him as a whole. He's going to get infinite power or something like that. I'm really curious as to see what happens, but ultimately, I think what's going to go down is, you know, that Queen Moon Star. Queen Moon Star. I really liked how they kind of added. Puts uh, a rift with uh, Hecapoo scissors. Hecapoo uh, scissors. Fabulous Hecapoo. Lechmith's uh, dust. Uh, Hecmith's of dust. dust. And just puts them in the. Uh, the portal, and as Moon is about to leave, Toffee's like, Tell Star, I'm coming for my finger. I'm coming. Uh, it's so good! So then we're back to the dance house with Star, and then Star goes back in her room. She notices this, she notices the portal, and then she sees her mom in her room. Oh my god, sees this moment. I saw an episode. Oh my. Danger. You saw an episode. Everyone saw this episode. It's so like, sad. And I don't want to go back. Like, wake up. You sent me here to the Diaz's without a choice. Now you're taking me back to the Union choice. Like, I'm making choices here. Leaves Earth. To have fun. I'm choosing this is our Earth. Earth. <laughs> Oscar. Blah, 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 blah. And then uh, Moon's like, Toffee's return. We gotta get back. Star's like, in disbelief. Like, no, 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 no. No, 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 we can't. That, that's, this isn't happening, this isn't happening. So then before Star leaves, uh, she goes back downstairs and then tells Marco that she really does have a crush on him, and she didn't, just didn't want to, uh, ruin everything, uh, that's why she was, like, holding in her feelings, and then she leaves, and then Marco runs after her, and... As Marco opens the door to Star's room, like, you can see the magic going away. Like, it's not her room anymore. It's just a normal house guest room. Like, the whole castle part that was sticking out of the Diaz's house, it's gone. Like, it's just a normal guest room. Now, Star, she, she's gone. She's gone. And then the episode ends there. That, fin like... Absolutely. God, Star Crush might be the best episode they've ever done in this entire show so far. It's yeah. un unreal how good this shit was. How like, unreal was that? how they kind of added the parallels between Star and Ludo of them being like really different from their uh, family heritage I guess and how Ludo got screwed over by Toffee it might yeah. add that parallel with Star getting uh, screwed over by Eclipsa by the way I they didn't mention Eclipsa, no, Eclipsa at all like there was no Eclipsa anything in uh, this finale yeah um, a lot of people were probably expecting that, but that's fine. Honestly, this finale is still amazing. Just seeing Toffee fuck everything up was, was enough for me. <laughs> Absolutely. The whole triangle, triangle between Marco, Jackie, and Star, you know, Star was just trying to... She was, they, she was trying to uh, make was things Yeah, just like I was watching uh, the movie. And when she uh, first talked movie. to Marco before uh, she left, uh, she talked to him once before, she was like, I just want things to go back to normal. Uh, yeah. I'm sick of everything. I'm sick of all this awkwardness. But things can't go back to normal. You know, it was proven at the end of the episode that things can't because she she really does like him and those feelings aren't going to go away. You know, she tried to uh, give up. I'm assuming he still has those in, in uh, his possession. He's got to go to beauty for sure. Like, that, that's a given. Like, first we're watching up. That's amazing. Ah. Hey guys, it's gonna be like. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! How will he do that? Oh, this is so good. Oh, oh. Alright, so that's the problem. Pretty much, I mean, 
Amazing. Thanks for watching.